Hello everybody, welcome. Now, the video I've done the other day with that food chopper, you remember that I got from Aldi? It's pretty good really for the money. And I went to the shop this morning and I saw this one, the mandolin. Never ever had one. Uh, there was only one left, so I suppose they've had them in for a few weeks, I suppose, but I'd never seen them. Uh, that was $4.99. Um, I've, had, I've had a look online about it, and uh, the reviews are pretty bad. So, let's test it. Uh, people say there's no instructions, well there wasn't in the other one either. I don't know how to change the blades. Um, people have cut their fingers. So let's have a crack at it anyway, and see what the score is with it. So let's open it up. Right, I've got a couple of items. Um, I've got a couple of soft items. I've got a tomato and a bit of cheese. Then I've got myself some potatoes, some sweet potato, and a bit of swede. Um, someone was asking me whether that food chopper I got would cut swede. So I'm going to try that again in a minute. And someone else asked me whether it cut potatoes. Uh, so, and I know it cuts the potatoes because I've done it yesterday in the food chopper. If you haven't seen the food chopper video, hold on. It's one of them. Well, I'll show you cutting the potatoes and we'll test it on the Swede in a minute. But in the meantime, let's try this thing. I've never ever used one, as I say. So let's open it up. If I can. I was saying, if it's rubbish, I'll take it back. Good thing about Aldi. I don't seem to moan. The people said there was no instructions in there. Well, there is in mine. On the uh, reviews, they said there was no instructions. I said they didn't know how to change the blades and that. Well, on mine, there's instructions. So then reviews were wrong. Get it all out. have a look okay never ever used one ever so I better get the instructions for this or oh, get my glasses on to change the blade underneath the mandolin push the clip at the top let's have a look uh, which is the top that's the top in it it was at the top no, that's the top. Push. Oh, they just pull it, push out. Yeah, they just push out. People said they couldn't change the blades. Well, that's quite easy. Well, is it? Push the blades. Then what? Hold on. Um. Yeah. There's only one blade anyway, isn't there? Oh no, there ain't, there's a couple. Yes, you can change the blade easy enough. I don't know what people were moaning at there on the... Mind you, they never had any instructions in the box. How'd you get it back in there? Like that, like that. And, like that was it. Can't bloody remember now, like that. I think. I don't know, I'm useless. Is that right? That ain't right, is it? Does it go that way? It doesn't go that way. Hold on a minute. I've got the instructions there. Look at me, look at me trying to work out right the instructions. I think that's it, innit? I think it goes like that. We'll find out anyways we cut along. Um... So let's cut some stuff anyway, I mean instructions, I mean how to use. I'm just going to cut things up and just see how we get on. Right, I've just been looking at the instructions on this. And I don't understand it. It says here, that's your blade thickness. So you move that up and down. But nothing moves. Your blade thing don't move there, look. Everything's exactly the same. And if you put that on there with some food, so you got your food there, we're going to stop that going up and down. So how do you get the blade thickness? And that don't move up and down because it's attached at the top. 
So I don't understand that at all. Anyway, let's cut some of it. Bloody thing. Let's do a let's do it some harder to start with. If I can get it in. Oh look, that isn't very good look. Not doing a lot, is it? For the top end. Rubbish! Absolute rubbish! Come on, stick on summit. But it wouldn't stick on a tomato. Let's try a spud. Chop an end off. Oh, chop a spud in half. That's rubbish. To start with, no potato. Um. Um, okay. I've got a funny feeling I'll be taking this back. Look at it. Goes on the flat end. No, don't. Just fell on the floor. Rubbish. <laughs> uh, try a bit of cheese. Let's have the cheese. Let's slice some cheese. What a load of rubbish. Try that way. And it just comes off, look. Rubbish. Uh, let's try a sweet potato. And it does say here, because I've read it, um, potatoes all on the floor now. Once the food is secure, place the hand guard with the food facing towards the mandolin. Use a knife to create a flat surface on the food. Let's cut both sides. This defeats the object, doesn't it, this? Right, flat surfaces, yeah? Mmm, flat surface. Rubbish, absolute rubbish. Potato, again, another one. There we go. Tomato won't even go in. Let's cut the tomato. Got a flat end. Well, there we go. What a load of rubbish. I'm not even going to bother trying the grater. It's a waste of time. Oh, let's move them out of the way. That'll go back to the shop. What a rip off that is. Now I'll see why it had loads of bad reviews. Well, I'm just going to do this for a couple of people. I want them to, to show it to, uh, to see. I'm going to show them. Get a spud. I've done these yesterday. And these work. These work. There's your spuds. So they do. And I've never done a swede. I'm going to have to cut that in half, ain't I? I mean, swede is quite tough, ain't it? I'll fit on there. I've got a funny feeling it won't do this, but we'll have a go. No. Turn it round that way. Nah, that'll break. It won't do swede. Unless we take the, the rough edge off there. Let me take the rough edge off. Let's try it now. No, it won't do Swede. I mean, it's made a mark in it. If that's any good, you want it fancy. Right then, worst product I've ever reviewed. That is a complete waste of money. Now, whether I was doing it right or not, but 
nothing sticks. So you're just wasting your time. It's got a stick for it to be able to, be able to do it. You don't just put it on my arm like that. Yeah, against the thing. It's got to be able to stick in. It's pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. So now we're going back to the shop. Don't buy it. Now you probably get better. Better ones than an Audi, obviously. They'll probably work. Well, that is rubbish. Um, I ain't doing nothing wrong. I might be doing anything wrong with this. But, that doesn't stick. Unless you get it and what, bash it down. That defeats the object, doesn't it? Let's see. Yeah, no, I'll just bash that onto the the board as well. Just going back to the shop. There you go. That was a quick one. I thought I'd try it. It'll go back. I'll get my money back. Don't work. As I say, I'm the old food guy. That's pathetic. Uh, till the next time. I'll see you later. Bye bye.